On this episode of Freaky Feasts, we're in Manila to try crocodile lechon. Lechon is a traditional Spanish recipe where a pig is roasted on a spit. So essentially that's what we're having, except instead of pig, we're having crocodile. Normally I'm the guy behind the camera, but today's meal so intrigued me that I had to sit down and try it myself. So we just saw an eight kilo crocodile get roasted on a spit, and this is the result. This is crocodile lechon. It looks kind of like chicken. The meat looks kind of like chicken. The chef apparently used a secret sauce which he wouldn't reveal to us, so I'm really anxious to try that. And I'm also going to be trying today a Dundee burger, which is made with crocodile meat. And then finally, a twist on a Filipino recipe, crocodile sisig. So I'm going to try this. Let's try the crocodile lechon. Mmm. That is damn good. I will write home to my mother about how good this was. Hi, Mom. Mmm. Zesty, tangy, very tender, smoky. Just all the, the great qualities you look for in good meat. This has been such a nice surprise. I wasn't sure what this was going to taste like going into it. I assumed some sort of chicken and it would have like a weird reptilian taste to it. This doesn't taste reptilian at all. It's, it really tastes like a mammal. Anyway, this looks kind of like a, the patty looks kind of like a, a veggie burger. There's some cheese on it and mayo and ketchup. Mm. It's also good. It tastes like a normal chicken burger with a lot of spices mixed in. Um, the crocodile doesn't really come through until you, until the, you swallow and you're left with a, a slightly gamey aftertaste. I, I prefer the lechon to the burger. So the last thing that we're going to try is crocodile sisig, which is a twist on a traditional Filipino recipe that's usually done with pork. And it kind of looks uh, like ground up crocodile with uh, spices and peppers. I see some onions in there. Um, and it's just served with a little bit of rice and a, a fried egg. Again, the lechon has a distinct and smoky taste and flavor. That doesn't come through in the, the seasick. This sort of tastes like any other meat. I would assume that this was ground up chicken or ground up pork. It doesn't taste like crocodile. Uh, it doesn't have that crocodile-y taste that um, I tasted in the lechon. In conclusion, after trying these three dishes, the seasick, the Dundee burger, and the lechon, I think the lechon is far and away the best. Um, and I think a lot of us have preconceived notions of what crocodile would taste like. You know, because it is like a big reptile that it's going to have a weird reptilian taste. Uh, I thought it was going to be kind of unctuous, um, but it is absolutely not that. If you're a carnivore, this would be on your, your bucket list.